So now we should be ready to start with our life cycle assessments, right? And as I said, there are two possibilities. We can either export these uh, material mappings to the web interface or we can try to get the results back into the plugin, right? So what we are going to do now is actually to, to use the web interface because we want to check that the materials that we have uh, actually chosen uh, make sense, right? In comparison to the materials of the database and also use the other um, checking options that the web interface offers. So for that reason, I usually prefer to go for the option to run DLC in cloud, at least uh, in my first attempt. So we just have to click on this button here, a new browser friendster pops up and it takes us to the website of my KLCA. You might have to log in here. And now we just have to select the project in which we want to import the these uh, mappings too, and also the design. And if, we, if you remember, we created this baseline design, and this is our calculation tool. And this is very important. We are using building no systems or openings. Um, this is important because in case that we were uh, importing our uh, system elements, right, M MEP, uh, we cannot <laughs> choose this category, otherwise these materials will be ignored. In that case, we should use all data, but we have no systems, we have no openings. So let's go for this option. And then we, we are going to replace the existing data. So yeah, overwrite, let's go on. So if we ungroup them, we are going to see different units. And if we group them, we are going to see just one entry with the thickness as the sum of the thicknesses of all materials. So let's move on. Let's go and 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 yeah, identify identify data 99.68%. Actually, uh, all the data should be mapped, but yeah, anyway. Okay, so this material is not available. For some reason, we can just choose another one. No problem. Uh, artificial stone slab, yeah, for instance. Okay, that should be it. And now let's continue. Okay, so <laughs> we can see that we have updated the construction materials uh, results, but let's click here once again. And yeah, we can see how we have all our materials here. <laughs> and of course, um, yeah, it seems more complete than before. And uh, you can imagine that this process has been more accurate and uh, quite faster than if we had done this with just uh, with uh, yeah, a manual method just typing in all the quantities here okay so that's basically it